glad to say that we won this race. With Rebecca Dallet's election to the Wisconsin Supreme Court, all but one of the seven justices will be women. Nationally, women make up 36% of state Supreme Court justices. In Wisconsin, it will be 86%. No other state has a higher percentage, and only Oregon comes close with five of seven. I certainly not wouldn't have dreamed that we would have gotten to the point of having six out of the seven as women. It's been 25 years since now retired Justice Janine Geske became the second woman to serve on the state's highest court. Geske, who's now a professor here at the Marquette Law School, believes that the high percentage of female justices will give this court a unique perspective. I think that, you know, there's a real understanding of what it's like to be a mother, what it's like to have worked and also raised a family. But she says those women also bring a strong mix to the court. The women are very different from each other. They have very different philosophies and approaches. Perhaps leading to conflict. Current Justice Rebecca Bradley says Dallet will have some fences to mend on the court over things said during the campaign. I think she will have some uh, relationships to repair. And so the Supreme Court moves forward with Walker appointee Justice Dan Kelly as the last man standing and Rebecca Dallet set to take her seat. I'm headed to the Supreme Court. In Milwaukee, I'm Kent Wainscott, WISN 12 News. Dallet will replace retiring Justice Michael Gableman, whose term expires at the end of July.